friends, the Generations Initiative is about a call for all of us to be a part of something bigger than ourselves. It's an invitation as we embark on what is needed for the next generation and generations to come. My parents started attending Orangewood when I was a year old and um, they had been looking for a church and um, one of the pastor's wives at the time came into a little shop that my mom was working at and they kind of struck up a conversation and um, basically she just invited her to Orangewood and so um, my parents came the first week. They showed up for Sunday school and Joe Creech was teaching Sunday school and um, they never left. We started coming to Orangewood um, maybe a year and a half, two years after um, I came back from Japan where I was stationed in the Navy and um, we, we tried out some other churches and then we kind of just said one week, let's just go to church with your parents and for this week. And after just kind of coming for several weeks, we felt embraced before by Orangewood before we embraced them. I was just thinking about how pretty much every big event in my life is somehow tied back to back to this place. You know, I was baptized here, um, I graduated here, I was married here. It, we, we started coming right around the time that we started having children and seeing our kids have friends whose parents were friends with Tabitha, whose grandparents were friends with my in-laws is a really neat thing for me. I feel that, you know, God sometimes continues His work in a single place, and that's a really beautiful thing. I think in my case, personally, um, you know, God is continuing the work that He began in my family generations ago, um, although that's been all over the place. Um, you know, my great-grandfather attended a, a big tent meeting where he met Jesus, and um, um, every generation since then has followed the Lord and you know I'm I'm here now and I feel like this is where God has me and um, and having moved around quite a lot I I very much see the value in being in one place and even though that wasn't something that I personally was able to provide for them um, I'm glad that my kids can have it through um, my wife's family being able to have my kids um, grow up in the same same place that I have has just been a really sweet thing. Um, a lot of the same people that poured into me when I was a little kid are still here and they're pouring into my children. And um, it's just a really beautiful picture of God's kingdom at work um, throughout the generations. You and I have the opportunity and privilege to declare God's mighty acts to the next generation and to our city so that every person may know that true and everlasting life is available to all who want it in the person of Jesus.